Good morning, friends. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, I'm so happy to have you. My name's Angela, and I quite literally just woke up, but I decided I was going to vlog today just because it's a nice chill Sunday. I can show you guys how I prepare for the week because I work full time, so I don't have a lot of time during the week. So on Sundays, I like to really take my day to prepare for the week that's about to come, and today we can spend that day together. I really hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope that it feels like we're just hanging out on a Sunday together, spending some time together, like friends would. I'm gonna try and do a Pilates video. I've honestly never done Pilates, but I always wanted to try it. So I'm gonna look up a Pilates video and try and do it. Honestly, I'm still like half asleep. I've been having this problem recently where when I wake up, I do not want to get out of bed at all. Like, I don't want to get out of bed at all. And then when I do get out of bed to turn off my alarm or whatever, I just want to get right back in bed. Like, I just never want to get out of bed recently. Especially in the mornings, I've been waking up feeling like really depressed for some reason. It's like the first thing I feel in the morning when I wake up is like depressed. So it makes it really hard to get out of bed. But I've been pushing myself through to get out of bed and I'm gonna try and do a Pilates video real quick and see if it'll wake me up a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then we'll go get a coffee because that'll definitely wake me up. really really uncomfortable right now in my skin and in my body and this happens sometimes in the morning when I wake up where I just feel really super uncomfortable in my skin and it feels like there's ants crawling all through my body and my therapist has talked through me through and my therapist has talked me through it before and it comes from anxiety and just being overwhelmed about life when I first wake up in the morning, but sometimes it's really hard for me to control and it's really hard for me to just feel comfortable in my skin. So I'm gonna listen to my body and I'm gonna stop my workout because I just do not, it just does not feel comfortable to me right now at all. And I'm gonna do some skincare instead. So I've come to the conclusion that today is going to be a pretty hard day for me mentally. So it's actually good that I decided to vlog because I can show you guys what it's like on a day that's harder to get through mentally when things just don't feel as comfortable to do and I just don't feel as comfortable in my body. Oh my god, the lighting, I'm sorry. And I just don't feel as comfortable in my body and yeah it's just harder to get through some everyday life things sometimes so hopefully today i can kind of show you more of what that's like let's do some skincare i'm trying to breathe through it but my body is literally shaking right now i have like so much anxiety inside me so i'm just gonna do my skincare try and calm down clearly as you saw I was having kind of a rough morning um, I'm feeling a little bit better now and I figured you know I'm having a rough morning so let me get myself a treat so I got Duncan 
and I got a bagel because I was like I'm not making myself anything because I feel like an anxious mess so I'm going to go get food instead so I'm gonna eat my bagel in this parking lot and then I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's I was just listening to Emma Chamberlain's podcast because listening to her podcast makes me feel like I'm just talking to a friend or something so yeah gonna eat my bagel And then, I'm going to go to Trader Joe's. really listen to myself and my body and everything when I've been struggling maybe having a bad mental health day recently I've been trying to just really listen to my body and do what it wants and do anything that can make me feel more comfortable and right now I'm just feeling exhausted from feeling anxious all morning and just like my body so tense all morning so I think I'm gonna take a nap right now and then I will check back in with you guys. Sorry, I know that this vlog isn't going to be very interesting, but this is really what it's like when a bad day hits you and you feel like you are having a really hard time doing everyday things. I was almost falling asleep at the grocery store, but I got through it and now I'm going to let myself take a nap. So I'll be back to check in with you guys in a bit. I'm only like semi awake right now, so bear with me, but I really want to make spring rolls, but they didn't have the like wraps you need to make them at Trader Joe's, and I also think I want to get some kind of like noodles to put in them, so I'm gonna go to... I'm gonna go run to a different grocery store right now, and hopefully they have the things that I'm looking for. Let's go. I'm gonna attempt to try and make spring rolls. I've never made these before and I'm just gonna wing it. So we'll see how this goes. Here is my final product. They obviously don't look perfect, but for my first time, I think I did a pretty good job. Let's try one. Let's try this one. Mmm. 
Yep. They taste amazing. What can I say? I'm quite a chef myself. Okay, I'm gonna go eat these in my bed, of course. And then we'll see where the day takes us. I'm sorry this is so boring, but honestly, this is the reality of what it's like to have a bad mental health day. I really just do the things that my body feels like it can do. I don't push myself to get anything done that I don't have to do. I don't push myself to do anything that I don't want to do. I just really listen to my body. I really try to stay in tune with myself. I try and do things that I hope will help me feel better, but um, they don't always work. <laughs> like I'll probably try and do some yoga in a little bit. I'll probably read a little bit. Just quiet things that hopefully will help me feel a little bit better. But yeah, I'm sorry this is boring, but I hope you guys still like hanging out with me. I hope it feels like we're just spending the day together because that's what we're doing. And yeah, I'm just gonna chill now again, probably for a while. I'm gonna take a shower and yeah, then we'll see what happens. Just made myself this smoothie and it's really good. In it, I put blueberries, bananas, maple syrup, vanilla almond milk, and peanut butter. So it's so simple and it's so good. And make sure the bananas and blueberries are frozen so that you get more of like a smooth or you get more of like a smoothie bowl ice cream kind of texture. so tired so I'm gonna end the video here and probably just chill for the rest of the night until I fall asleep thank you guys so much for watching I hope it felt like we spent the day together I hope you have a good rest of your night rest of your day whenever you're watching this as always my guide on how to get help will be linked in the description box below I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe. I love you all. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.